This is what they mean when they say life is what you make of it. This job was disgusting. There's no way around it. I know plumbing can be pretty gross, but there are jobs that are way worse than others. And the reason for this being so disgusting is all of the mold. You can't see it all in the video, but it was everywhere on the ceilings and walls as well. Now, luckily for these tenants, while I was here, there's also a restoration company here to prepare and make all the repairs necessary for all of that. And this is why I said life is what you make of it. You can focus on how disgusting or how bad your job is or look at it in the lens of, well, I'm helping somebody providing a service that is necessary for people, regardless of how gross it is. And at the same time, providing for your family. And you're probably like, a plumber complaining his job is gross? That's not the point, but you know, I just don't like mold, man. It's disgusting and it can make you sick. We're actually not even supposed to use that word. It's like the equivalent of saying Voldemort. If you've done this kind of work, you know, you have to say organic growth material. Anyway, enough of that. If you notice, I used a male adapter for the pecs there. I picked that trick up from Plumber's Plunger. Great idea for pec shutoffs. Also, I'm not going to say what brand this toilet is, but I'll say it rhymes with Glacier Bay. What are you guys doing with these toilet seat designs, man? If I've got to read instructions to install a toilet seat, something's wrong. Basically, you got to tighten it twice. Makes no sense. But as always, once I'm done setting a toilet, I check for leaks, make sure it flushes properly, and that's it. Thanks for watching.